Hey guys, how's morning. it going? Yeah, good, good. Wow, good, what good. we got here? So we got some amazing fish coming this morning. The fish plunger actually texted me this morning at four o'clock and he brought it in literally a couple of hours ago. I think we can use this fish to make a nice uh, yeah. soup as a main course. Pano, what sort of vegetables came in? We have a couple of uh, globe artichokes, yeah. which they look really, really fresh. Let's make a stalk, a nice a la Greg stalk, make a nice mm -hmm. puree next to it. It's going to be perfect for lunch, very cool. light yeah. as well. Yeah. Great, sounds good. Yeah, let's do it. Being in a company that tried to create something so unique that hasn't happened before, it gives me a lot of power in my menus. The concept of the kitchen and what we're gonna provide for our residents is, is gonna be completely different to restaurants. There's nothing been done like this ever before. I'm working with a fishmonger down there in uh, Brixham. So all our fish that we get here is wild caught. By the time the fish reaches here, it's maybe less than 10 hours that it's been caught. Hadley, can I get a couple of uh, gallons of water in uh, Jack, please? Yep. We got carrots, onions, um, leek, celery. This is just our beginning. This is just our stock to create the base to cook our soup in. Pano, start peeling the artichokes. If you go too deep, you, you're mm -hmm. losing too much. You need to go just a little bit here. Okay with it? Yeah, you're hungry? These are nice. <laughs> <laughs> These broad beans actually, they're so fresh and, um, and young, it's gonna give us a very nice crunchiness in the dish. It's a recipe my mom always used to make and it's not gonna be exactly the same, like she makes it, but because the memory of that taste is so strong, I think we can replicate it in a, in a way that actually makes sense. Here we're trying to create like a work-life balance, which is very important. We want people to come here and develop some really great ideas and learn some new things. Once it's ready, quick plates and then we go for plating. If you've got time to stand, you've got time to clean. <laughs> the sense of community for us is, uh, is fundamental. You know, we're here to stay. And uh, it's really important to be able to work with all these people that is in the neighborhood. Say, oh, we're gonna, we're gonna buy a small batch of goat cheese, for example. Then we will infuse it with different flavors that we want. And then we give it to Paxton and they will age it for us. It gives us power on the same time. We can create products that is unique and they only come out of our kitchen. I think everybody feels at home when the food is good and it reminds them of their home, you know? We've put so much uh, thought and effort in making sure that the whole experience of takeaway of Orient is far different from what we create in the restaurant, different from what you would experience in the bar. It's just created for in apartment dining. It's very comfort food, food that you would normally cook at home. Because Orient is something that people will have to feel like home. So let's try this. The is great, really great. It's, it's a nice and safe place in your mouth and nice yep. earthy flavors from the, yep. from the artichoke and the puree. You can taste every element on the plate. It's not overcomplicated. Everything is going to come together that nicely. Yeah. Great. We should keep this on the menu then. Yeah. Well, of course, we will. <laughs> we will for sure.